Hello and welcome to the ASUS Creators Academy. My name is Tio and I'm an artist, graphic designer and urban sketcher who enjoys sketching out on location around Singapore. In this tutorial, I'm going to give you a quick introduction to the process of creating digital hand-drawn art. The tools we'll need would be a tablet, preferably one that supports an active stylus. This tablet that I have here happens to be the ASUS VivoBook 13 Slate OLED. An active stylus is one where a cursor will appear when the pen is near the display. If you do not have an active stylus or your tablet doesn't support an active stylus, you can also use pens with the rubber tip or the disc tip. The software we are going to use is Concepts. This app is based on the freemium model, which is to say that it's free to use. However, certain tools are locked behind a paywall. For our tutorial, the free tools will be sufficient. You can head over to concepts.app to find and install the software. Once you have the app open, it's going to look blank. So I have all these artworks here because I have been using this app for several years. And this is a drawing of my two-month-old daughter. Don't worry, in this tutorial, we are not going to be drawing something as complicated as a cityscape. We are just going to draw something really simple. Just a bottle of hand wash. All right, let's draw. Let's start by creating a new file. You can tap on the plus icon here, or you can go to the menu here and tap on new drawing. The tools for drawing would be located here in this dial. There is also the layers palette here and the precision palette here. The first thing to do is to choose a drawing tool. So just tap on one of the drawing tools here and tap again to choose the brush to use. Let's choose the dynamic pen, which is suitable for use if you have an active stylus. So once you have selected the brush, it will be stored here. And next, let's choose a color. Um, we are going to choose black. Opacity or the transparency is listed here. So now it's at 70%. So let's just make it 100%. The shortcut to do so is to tap on this icon and drag to the right. So we are just going to draw a bottle of hand wash. You can look for reference photos online or you can just look at the bottle of hand wash you have at home. So let's have um, the shape like this. So let's choose another tool that we'll use for coloring. The tool that we are using is called Fill. So just set the Fill tool here and choose a color. Let's choose a darker orange color. If a layer is not created automatically for you when you selected the Fill tool, you can always create your own layer. Just tap here, New Layer. We want the colors to be beneath the line, so tap and hold this layer, drag it beneath the line art. You may want to rename this layer, so just tap on the layer and tap this button here to rename. Using layers is very important when it comes to creating digital art, so it's very helpful to have the layers palette open all the time. So make sure you have selected the correct layer before you add the colors to that layer. Now if you have colors coming out of the line, you can undo by using two fingers to tap on the display and redraw again. Now this is a sketch, so I'm not going to be that careful. So I have the liquid in the bottle. I also want to add some shadows here and here, maybe here and here. Let's say there is a label on the bottle, so we can create a new layer for the white label. I'm going to create another layer for the design on the label. So for the design, I'm just going to write some words on it. So the beauty of using layers is if you don't want the label, you can actually just turn off the visibility of the layers or you can delete the layers. With digital art, it's easy to make changes. So let's say I want to change the color of the liquid. I just need to use this selection tool represented by the arrow. A pop-up will appear here telling you the type of selection tool you have. So if it's lasso, change it to item picker and use the arrow to select the colored shape 
and change it to some other color you will have to change this color as well done so that's the absolute basics when it comes to creating digital hand-drawn art there are many drawing apps available out there i'm very sure you will be able to find one that suits your style as to how far you want to take your art it's really up to you for more tutorials and tips visit the asus singapore youtube channel or the creators academy's website thanks for watching see you again bye create with asus